What is going on, you beautiful people? It is Trelly here. We are back with another rank duel video. This time, I wanted to dive into the world of Raijin again. I haven't played Raijin since he was good, which was a long friggin' time ago, if you remember that. We're up against a Cupid. Uh, interesting. I haven't played against a Cupid in a while either, so this is going to be a battle of the minds. Um, usually I wouldn't get a point in my three, but you know what? Points and everything here isn't the worst thing in the world. I've been seeing a lot of people go this build. Um, because if you haven't seen Sorcerer's Staff, when you level up, you heal 15% of your max health and mana. So it's a lot of sustain. And then I can just go sprint, so I never have to worry about his ult. And that sounds pretty good to me. Um, but hey, maybe it's going to suck. That's definitely a possibility as well. Make sure you stack up Raijin passive before you leave the base. Let's get out there. Uh, I just want to go for blue, to be honest, as a mage gamer. It's not very fun to miss out on your blue buff early on. This is a matchup that can be very tough. But I should be able to just snowball. I'm thinking about just going into Bancrofts immediately. And then we'll go from there. Like, leave the tier 2, not build into the Warlocks. And just go Bancrofts. That sounds kind of good to me. Um, so I'm doing it. Gonna do that. Use everything. Pop the old motion. Probably finish this off with a two and an auto attack. Then save the rest for later. We should be out clearing him pretty easily. Three, four, five, six. Oh, he's on red. I was going to say, like, he's still doing it. Oh my goodness, this clear is so bad. Or he messed something up. Okay. That's fine by me. Okay, so I tanked up the blue buff, which was dumb. Uh, I said it was fine by me. It was not. The blue buff definitely did 100% of my HP there. <laughs> I took 425 from the blue buff. I don't know why. I thought that his... Uh, I thought that his heart bomb was going to kill them, so I wouldn't have to worry about it. And I uh, oh, certainly did. Hopefully he ults this. He didn't? Okay. Not a bad start. Honestly. Not the end of the world. Didn't use anything. Got first blooded. Easy enough. We don't care about all this. We got ourselves a level, so we are healing. Yeah, his, his going for the blue buff there, though, was just him dying. Like, that was a really bad play by him. It ended up working because I'm bad and tanked the buff instead of just walking out and sprinting. Um, but yeah, the fact that he did that with the amount of HP he had, even with Horrific, tells me that this is going to be pretty free. Like, you saw how much health he had here. And he still went in. And I was baffled by it. And I still died. <laughs> I don't want to fight him yet. Like tier two and Bancrofts. Just not quite there. I'm oh, nothing gonna kill. Just gonna be, can I hit the two in the auto attack? Oh. I didn't hit the auto attack, if you were curious. What the hell happened there? Did I actually miss it? Or did I miss my two? I don't know, man. I'm zoned out right now. I'm a little bit zoned out. If you must know, I was trying to get some joust recordings. And I faced against the GM3 stack, which sucked, but that it's okay. It happened. So then I queued again. And I faced against the same GM3 stack. And the funny part is, I lost zero MMR both times. So I was like, okay... The game, and again, I'm solo queue, so it was like very difficult of a game. I almost want to, um, but my point is the game said, oh, this game was so incredibly unbalanced that we're not going to fault you and we're not going to take any MMR from you. And then they said, but we are going to put you against these guys again. And that's the part I don't understand. I don't mind losing zero. I don't mind facing GM three stacks when I'm solo queue. The majority of Joust probably should be GM three stacks. Or I mean, three stacks. But why? If they are so incredibly unbalanced, are you putting me in against the same team twice? Just make my teammates better to compensate. I'll sit in a longer queue. 
You know what I'm saying? I would gladly sit in a longer queue to get a more balanced game. A more balanced experience. That's easy enough. Um, so that's what that's the part I don't like. You know what I'm saying? Like I don't mind facing three stacks. It happens. Can't believe he stepped back in. But yeah, again, I could kind of tell from that first play that he made that this was gonna be a bit of a stomp. I just trolled about as hard as you can for first blood. <laughs> Shouldn't matter though. Shouldn't be a problem. I'm gonna go into a chalice. Like you guys were all probably just like cringing watching me get first blooded, and I was too, so don't worry about it. Dude. Okay, I got so confused. For some reason that looked like the tier two breastplate to me, this one. And I was like, why is he going fizzy? Oh, nah, nah. What's my name? Honestly, thought that I would have killed him a little bit sooner. Took a lot longer than I would have expected. Is there a special on this? There's not. Nah, there's a special on the lightning one. The lightning one. Gee, that's Ryzen, and I said the lightning one. That's insane work by me. Um, I'm talking about the one where he's like... I was... I, I shit you not. My brain is so mush. I was going to say he's a drummer. That would have been insane work by me. Part 12. Hmm. I really expected... I really expected the horrific into the old, but seems like this will be the F6er, unfortunately. Didn't want it to be, but it happens. If you saw my Uller game yesterday, this is the same sort of vibe. I do, more often than not, have to troll a fair bit to get recorded to the duel. Like, I didn't troll for first blood. Let me rephrase that. I didn't... In, it, like, I... I I didn't do it on purpose, you know what I mean? Like, I'm, I wasn't dicking around. I just was bad. I'm gonna have to dial it back or this guy's gonna give up, is my point. That was not what First Blood was, though. That was just me trolling. And I think you guys knew that. I think that was relatively obvious. I'm gonna assume it was, given the fact that I got horrific inside of a blue buff and stood there and just took it and said, yep. You are out of my league. Well, would an actual smart gamer stick around with this amount of HP? I'll let you be the judge. Because I'm not fucking leaving. I don't know what relic I want. He's going to crit. Okay. Okay. That makes things more interesting. Maybe he won't have six then. Rampage. So Don't really have to think too much. My ult hits him for like what? 400 right now? Not bad. You've probably seen me use the damage one every time. And you might be asking yourself, Try, why are you using the damage one every time? Why the hell not? No, <laughs> Honestly. He's always within barrel stuff range. What's the fucking point? Why wouldn't I? <laughs> Uh, I could go double defense here pretty easily and just counter with spectral like spectral and breastplate and call it a day I'm definitely thinking about it We're up by so much that it's not gonna be on the forefront of my mind, but Definitely something we can consider I'm Trying to figure out if I want to go chrono spend it which I do Oh, we gotta hit those I missed everything. Darn. You wouldn't dare, right? Oh, 
Does he dare ult? He thought about it. He definitely thought about it. Truthfully, though, it's probably just cooldown med. That's what I was going to go. I'm honestly curious as to what he's going to go, but I, I don't think it matters. <laughs> I honestly do not think it matters what bro gets. Even with Demon Blade, like, how many auto attacks does he really hit on me? It's going to take him a while to get anti-heal. Let's see if he's on this. What am I looking at? Bro said, nah, I'd win. And he was fucking wrong. <laughs> like, why didn't he dash away immediately? Well, unfortunately, the wave didn't clear like I thought it would. So we got no backup here. I honestly thought I cleared more of the wave, but... It was him who cleared the wave, and I watched, apparently. As it were. You are... Dude, I, I'm wondering, because he's not going to go Kins. Oh no, I'm so scared. Oh, oh. Dash on me, dash on me, dash on me. He didn't dash on me. Why didn't he dash on me? What did he dash in here, you think? I really want him to dash in on me, but he just doesn't want to. Okay. Well, clearly I need Divine, because he's just healing. Do, do, do. I'm still healing. Better than I ever did. This doesn't really make much sense. I've got the brain of a little kid. Like, I'm still standing and I'm still healing. There really wasn't much keeping those two together as far as my brain goes. Um, Because I said he's healing. I didn't say I'm still healing. <laughs> so it didn't really make any bit of sense. I'm going to get wards and probably go for fire. I'm tired of this bozo. You are out of my league. I blame Jesse. I was watching Infamous Jesse stream and he was playing that song and now I keep fucking singing it to you guys. Uh, I'm just dashing right over. That dude's right in the corner. Bruh. What the? I'll remember you. Get over here, dork. Right You're getting dashed on, bucko. And we leveled up too. I love it. I love it. We leveled up to give us enough sustain to actually do this in a relatively easy manner. Um, let's just get Claw Power Pot. I think that's my best option here. We could have upgraded Med as well, but he used Horrific. He didn't use his Thorns. That's something we got to watch out for. But... Claw power pod is kind of insane. Of a spike. Because our ult is going to be up. His is not. I'm just going to dash on him immediately. Oh. GG friend. A G. A G. Maybe not actually. 20 seconds. I mean, it definitely should be, but like, you know, sometimes it takes a while to kill Titans. Like I have fire minions. Nah, not quite. I'll get a little bit more. Oh, never mind. I was gonna say I'll get a little bit more damage off, but Titan just said, nah, I'm good. Let's get ourselves a Fred buff. He has double crit now. No Deathbringer, but double crit. Let's see. And again, I'm not going to build, um, I'm not going to build into the Warlocks, but he doesn't have kin, so it actually wouldn't be bad at all. <laughs> but most people that I see do this, like Jesse and Twig and, you know, 
those are the guys I see doing. I was going to name more people, but it's really just them. Um, they just leave it. They don't actually upgrade it. So I'll leave it too. I think in mage v mage matchups, Warlocks is probably pretty good. And into Hunters, it's probably really bad. But when they don't go Kins, it's like, there's honestly no reason not to upgrade it. Besides the fact that it helps me get other power spikes later on. Uh, I'm going to dash on him here for sure, but he's probably going to horrific and just all in. I don't mind. He needed to, but he didn't for some reason. I don't know why he didn't. I'll get upgraded in Madden as well. There we go. I just want to upgrade the old meditation. Get a little quicker there. 9 one and oh. Not bad. We died once to Horrific Emblem blue buff, and the blue buff did infinitely more damage than he did. So definitely not a bad game. Um, I'm sure you all cringed for the first blood, and you can roast me. Please roast me in the comments section below. But you also have to praise me for making the comeback as well. All right, that's the rule here. If you're going to cook me for getting first blooded, also praise me uh, for the comeback and say hi to Zeus because he is a good boy. Um, Divine would have been the call that I would have sold this Warlocks for. I mean... <sighs> Anti-crit if I needed it, but more than likely, it would have just been like Rod. But yeah, Spectral, Gem of Iso, Rod, all would have been options there. I hope you guys found some enjoyment. If you did, you already know what to do. Leave a like, drop a comment, and subscribe. Good try, guys. Peace.